Exam practice test one. Listening part one. Now look at the instructions for part one. For each question, choose the correct picture. Look at question one. One. Where's the girl going this afternoon? Are you coming shopping with me and mom this afternoon? To buy your new skateboard. I'd love to, but I'm meeting my classmate Susan. We're going to see that new Japanese cartoon. Okay, no problem. Mom can help me choose a skateboard. And mom wants to go to the new cafe in Bridge Street. Great! They sell fantastic cakes. Now listen again. Are you coming shopping with me and mom this afternoon? To buy your new skateboard. I'd love to, but I'm meeting my classmate Susan. We're going to see that new Japanese cartoon. Okay, no problem. Mom can help me choose a skateboard. And mom wants to go to the new cafe in Bridge Street. Great! They sell fantastic cakes. Two. Which is the boy's new desk? Mum's bought me a desk for my bedroom, Aunt Barbara. Yes, she was looking at one online with four drawers. Did she get that one? Mine's got two drawers on the left and three shelves on the right. That's good. You've got lots of books and things. Can I go upstairs and look at it? Sure. Now listen again. Mum's bought me a desk for my bedroom, Aunt Barbara. Yes, she was looking at one online with four drawers. Did she get that one? Mine's got two drawers on the left and three shelves on the right. That's good. You've got lots of books and things. Can I go upstairs and look at it? Sure. Three. How will they get to their tennis class? Are we going to go to our tennis class by bike today? The weather's good. Yes, it's sunny but not too hot. But I've got a problem with my back wheel, so I'd prefer to go by bus. Or we could walk. It's not far. Good idea. My dad says he'll fix my bike next weekend. Now listen again. Are we going to go to our tennis class by bike today? The weather's good. Yes, it's sunny but not too hot. But I've got a problem with my back wheel, so I'd prefer to go by bus. Or we could walk. It's not far. Good idea. My dad says he'll fix my bike next weekend. Four. Which woman is Laura's new English teacher? Mum, you see the woman outside the bookshop. That's my new English teacher. The woman with long dark hair. She looks like your aunt Susanna. But aunt Susanna's got blonde hair. Anyway, it's the other woman with short dark hair and glasses. Oh, she looks really friendly. Now listen again. Mum, you see the woman outside the bookshop. That's my new English teacher. The woman with long dark hair. She looks like your aunt Susanna. But aunt Susanna's got blonde hair. Anyway, it's the other woman with short dark hair and glasses. Oh, she looks really friendly. Five. What might Harry do if it rains on Saturday? Hi, Harry. Are you going to go running on Saturday to practice for the school race? Possibly, but it might rain. If it does, I don't want to be outside. What about playing badminton in the sports hall? 
I like badminton, but my friends don't. We all like volleyball, and that's good exercise too, so I'll think about that. Now listen again. Hi, Harry. Are you going to go running on Saturday to practice for the school race? Possibly, but it might rain. If it does, I don't want to be outside. What about playing badminton in the sports hall? I like badminton, but my friends don't. We all like volleyball, and that's good exercise too, so I'll think about that. That is the end of part one. Exam practice test one, listening part two. Now look at part two. For each question, write the correct answer in the gap. Write one word or a number or a date or a time. Look at questions six to ten now. You have ten seconds. Now, I want to tell you about a new school music club. It'll begin on the 15th of September, and there will be classes once a week until December the 18th. Let me check the day, because there's the sports club on Wednesdays. The music club will be on Thursdays. It'll be after school. Your last lessons finish at 10 to 4, and you can have a break before the music club because it starts at 20 past four and ends at five o'clock. Here's some information about the teacher. His name's Mr. Taylor. I'll spell that for you. T-A-Y-L-O-R. You don't know him because he's new. If your parents would like to phone him, he's happy for me to give you his phone number. It's zero. Double seven nine three eight six five two one. Oh, you need to know where to go for the club. It's going to be in the library. Use the doors next to the art room because the other doors won't be open then. Now listen again. Now, I want to tell you about a new school music club. It'll begin on the 15th of September, and there will be classes once a week until December the 18th. Let me check the day, because there's the sports club on Wednesdays. The music club will be on Thursdays. It'll be after school. Your last lessons finish at 10 to 4, and you can have a break before the music club because it starts at 20 past four and ends at five o'clock. Here's some information about the teacher. His name's Mr. Taylor. I'll spell that for you. T-A-Y-L-O-R. You don't know him because he's new. If your parents would like to phone him, he's happy for me to give you his phone number. It's zero. Double seven nine three eight six five two one. Oh, you need to know where to go for the club. It's going to be in the library. Use the doors next to the art room because the other doors won't be open then. That is the end of part two. Listening part three. Now look at part three. For each question, choose the correct answer. Look at questions 11 to 15 now. You have 20 seconds. Charlotte, I've got the computer game called Green Space.
Where did you find out about it, Lewis? I borrowed a magazine from a school friend, and there was an ad for it. I asked my mum, and she bought it for me from their website. I really like that game. It's not new, but it's my favourite game because it isn't easy. I play it a lot, which is strange because it's not funny at all. Who are you going to play it with? Well, my brother's too busy studying, and my cousin Amy only likes board games. But my granddad has lots of time, so I want to play with him. How long do you usually play it for? When I was sick last Wednesday, I played for an hour and a half. Then on Friday, an hour, and on Saturday, three quarters of an hour. Which part do you like best? Crossing the river's really good, but the bit I enjoy most is finding something to eat. The part about building a hut's my least favourite. Now listen again. Charlotte, I've got the computer game called Green Space. Where did you find out about it, Lewis? I borrowed a magazine from a school friend, and there was an ad for it. I asked my mum, and she bought it for me from their website. I really like that game. It's not new, but it's my favourite game because it isn't easy. I play it a lot, which is strange because it's not funny at all. Who are you going to play it with? Well, my brother's too busy studying. And my cousin Amy only likes board games, but my granddad has lots of time, so I want to play with him. How long do you usually play it for? When I was sick last Wednesday, I played for an hour and a half. Then on Friday, an hour, and on Saturday, three quarters of an hour. Which part do you like best? Crossing the river's really good. But the bit I enjoy most is finding something to eat. The part about building a hut's my least favourite. That is the end of part three. Exam practice test one, listening part four. Now look at part four. For each question, choose the correct answer. Sixteen. You will hear two friends talking about shopping. What did the boy buy yesterday? I'm glad I got the school book I wanted yesterday. Yes, my mum had already bought that and a new magazine for me. Everyone thinks the gloves I got yesterday are cool too. The T-shirt I liked was really colourful, but nearly one hundred pounds. I know. Let's buy some snacks now. We can eat them during break at school. Now listen again. I'm glad I got the school book I wanted yesterday. Yes. My mum had already bought that and a new magazine for me. Everyone thinks the gloves I got yesterday are cool too. The T-shirt I liked was really colourful, but nearly one hundred pounds. I know. Let's buy some snacks now. We can eat them during break at school. Seventeen. You will hear a teacher talking to a student called Lynn. Why didn't Lynn come to school yesterday? Mr. Jones, could I ask you about the tennis match on Saturday? Of course, Lynn. You missed class yesterday. Do you feel better? Oh, I wasn't ill. We were camping in Switzerland for a week, and our flight was cancelled on Sunday. We flew on Monday instead. Oh, okay. So next Saturday is really important. If we win, we'll win the championship.
Now listen again. Mr. Jones, could I ask you about the tennis match on Saturday? Of course, Lynn. You missed class yesterday. Do you feel better? Oh, I wasn't ill. We were camping in Switzerland for a week, and our flight was cancelled on Sunday. We flew on Monday instead. Oh, OK. So next Saturday is really important. If we win, we'll win the championship. Eighteen. You will hear a boy talking about surfing. How did he learn to surf? When I started surfing, I went to the beach with friends and tried and tried, but I didn't seem to improve. Then I saw that someone was organising lessons, but they were on Fridays when I play football. In the end, I found a website with a famous surfer showing people the best way to learn. That's what helped me. 18. You will hear a girl talking about her day at school. Which subject did she like best? School was great today. First, we had a lesson about oceans and the average water temperature in each one. But the most interesting lesson was about bees, how they live together and how they develop from eggs to adults. In another lesson, we read part of a novel and, for homework, we can write either a story or an article. 18. You will hear two brothers talking about last night. Why did they both sleep badly? I'm tired this morning. I didn't sleep well. Neither did I. Let's ask Dad to turn down the heating in our room. Yes, that was the problem. I can hear him outside. I think he's packing the car so that we are ready to go camping. I can hear Mum playing music downstairs. Let's ask her about the heating. Yeah. 18. That is the end of part four. Exam practice test one, listening part five. Now look at part five. For each question, choose the correct answer. Look at questions 21 to 25 now. You have 15 seconds.
Mum, we talked about different jobs in class today, and I'm surprised about the jobs some of my friends want to do. What do you want to do? You know I love planes, so I'd like to fly them for my job. Great idea. What job does Tyler want to do? He wants to work at the hospital. His mum's a receptionist there, but he wants to take care of people's teeth. That's a good job. Ava wants to be a sports coach, doesn't she? Not now. She wants to show tourists round different towns. Oh, and Mark? He's always helping his dad repair cars. Remember, his dad's got a garage, and that's what he wants to do. He'll be good at that. Does Victoria know what she wants to do? Yes, to write articles for a newspaper. She wrote a good story about an actor for English last week. Great. What about Bobby? He wants to be in plays and work in theatres all over the world. He was good in the school play about a hospital. Now listen again. Mum, we talked about different jobs in class today, and I'm surprised about the jobs some of my friends want to do. What do you want to do? You know I love planes, so I'd like to fly them for my job. Great idea. What job does Tyler want to do? He wants to work at the hospital. His mum's a receptionist there, but he wants to take care of people's teeth. That's a good job. Ava wants to be a sports coach, doesn't she? Not now. She wants to show tourists round different towns. Oh, and Mark? He's always helping his dad repair cars. Remember, his dad's got a garage, and that's what he wants to do. He'll be good at that. Does Victoria know what she wants to do? Yes, to write articles for a newspaper. She wrote a good story about an actor for English last week. Great. What about Bobby? He wants to be in plays and work in theatres all over the world. He was good in the school play about a hospital. That is the end of part five. You now have six minutes to write your answers on the answer sheet.